Republicans in the Wisconsin legislature are pressing forward with an amendment to the state constitution to take power from the governor. J.T. Siskowski has you covered on what the amendment would change and why environmental activists are raising the alarm. Wisconsin voters may soon decide if the governor is allowed to keep spending money given to the state by the federal government. Republicans in the legislature are advancing this constitutional amendment to give themselves that power. If passed by lawmakers, a referendum for final approval would go on November's ballot. Wisconsin communities regularly depend on a governor's authority to be able to quickly deploy federal dollars to respond to emergencies. Jennifer Gietrich with Wisconsin Conservation Voters worries lawmakers can't move fast enough to distribute money in a crisis. Puts people in a vulnerable position when we can least afford to do that. In this testimony supporting the amendment, Republican State Senator Howard Markline argues, quote, this resolution increases accountability, efficiency, and transparency in the expenditure of funds received from the federal government. But of course, this proposed constitutional amendment wouldn't just affect political happenings up here at the state capitol. Climate activists are primarily concerned about how this amendment would impact Wisconsin's future generations. We're standing here on a 40 degree day in the middle of February, and we need to take action now if we're going to preserve the health of our communities. Abby Navinska with Healthy Climate Wisconsin thinks the amendment would slow the response to climate change, and that has personal meaning for her. I'm concerned about the health impacts because I've seen them already in my family and friends. She doesn't want the state slowing action. We don't need to delay funds in order for communities to get care. In Madison, J.T. Siskowski, 27 News.